Vaughn, I just got back from the gym and I can't make my free throws on the court. What's wrong? Yeah, I got an idea. Imagine this scenario. You just got past a guy on the court and he pushes and fouls you. You have to go to the line and make your free throws. What are you going to do? Well, take a tip from the pros like Jeff Hornacek, who touches his face three times, and Steve Nash, who shoots two imaginary free throws, and make yourself a free throw ritual. Hi, my name is Vaughn, and I'm here to show you how to bring some consistency to your free throw. Let's take a look at what an untrained free throw looks like. Uh-oh, bad form, Nicholas. When doing a free throw ritual, there are three F's. First F is focus. No matter what you're doing, be sure to keep your eye on the basket at all times. Nice shot. The second F is footing. Make sure to keep your feet shoulder width apart and an adequate distance from the free throw line. Don't forget to bend your knees. Your third F is fun. Just have fun with it. As you can see, an expert likes to play with his hair and dribble at least five times. What a shot. Now let's see what our friend Nick has learned. We see at least five dribbles, focus, footing. That'll come in handy in the clutch. All right, Nick, so do you think you learned anything? No. And those are my essentials to a free throw ritual. Remember, focus, footing, fun. Get out there and happy shooting.